This segment's really about how to make your bed and how to set up a really glamorous bed. The first thing you'll notice here is this oversized headboard, and that's really a project you can do yourself. It's actually plywood that is cut into squares. It's got foam glued on it, and the fabric is wrapped around and stapled to the back. It's Velcroed to the wall, and there's a trim detail that goes all the way around, and we painted that the color of the wall. It really gives you this very dramatic headboard. It's also great if you have two beds in a bedroom with a night table in between, two twins in a children's room, and you can push them together. Now, one of the really glamorous parts of this is mirrored furniture, and these mirrored night tables really are that. They really add a wonderful, sparkly quality. And to balance that are these crystal lamps, these thick crystal lamps. Now, often when you're looking at these crystal lamps, you have to be aware that the wire is on the outside of the lamp, but that's not a problem. That's the quality of the crystal. It's solid crystal. And then light shades. When you're using lamps by the bed, you can either use a lacquered shade or a linen shade. The linen shade allows the light to come through, which is better when you're reading in bed because the light comes through, not just down. Now, a lot of people say, why does my bed not look like it does in the package? Well, that's where you should start. You should look at the package and look at the picture because when we're doing this and when we're designing beds and, and doing these photo shoots, we're styling the bed with all the components to give you that information. But let me show you what I did on this bed. So we start with the duvet cover, and you've got, this is a queen bed, and sometimes if you want really fluffy, you can go with the next size up. You can even stick a king duvet in a queen duvet cover, and that really makes it fluffy. But what we've done is we've taken the flat sheet, we've laid it on the mattress first. We haven't tucked it in. We've put the duvet on, folded this over. Now the duvet is folded over again so that you don't see that seam in between where the two fabrics, where the back of the fabric and the front of the fabric starts. It also gives you that fluffiness. At the back, we have what's called Euro Shams, and these are the large square pillows. You don't really sleep with them. They just add really a nice quality to the bed. You can lean against them and read against them. We have your sleeping pillow, which are the pillow cases, and I tend to put those in the middle because that's what you're sleeping with. So when they get wrinkled, you don't really notice that. You just see the cuff on the edge. And then we've got the pillow shams at the front. Now many of them are reversible, so you can either use this side or this side. You can mix them up and really change the bed. So what you can do is the back of the duvet cover is this color. You can have the whole duvet in the stripes and change it up and do the pattern so you get a completely different look. Also accents these small pillows that match the shams and this decorative one and this quilted pattern is on the bed skirt. Really, this is the way to get a luxurious bed, and it's really easy.